Okay, we're gonna ignore the heavy equipment noises in the background because the plumbers are here doing work on the septic. Heather has a great question. What's a tincture? No need to apologize because you know what? Not everybody knows. Let's talk about it. So quick definition here. In the herbalist world, a tincture is an extraction typically done by alcohol or vinegar. Some people do use glycerin from plant-based materials to get the benefits into the liquid and then it is meant to be used internally. In layman's terms now. You take some of this plant material here and sometimes some other plant material here to do some of the similar benefits. If you're feeling froggy, take a little bit of another one and mix it in too. Get yourself a jar and some alcohol or vinegar and you put the liquid things with the dry things in the jar and then you let it sit out of direct sunlight for two to six weeks. And when that's done, grab yourself a strainer and some cheesecloth, separate out your plant material from your liquid, and the liquid left behind is tincture, which we then, being an herbalist business, this is our full-time income, take them from that big jar right there, put them into dropper bottles right there, slap a label on it on the front so you know what it is, and a label on it on the back so you know what it's used for and how much and how often to take it, and then you guys can head over to our shop and buy them to which then I will do something like this on the table to turn them into things that look like that. That gets carried off to the post office and will show up at your house or your mailing address within like three to five business days. Now that three to five business days is after I've dropped it off to the post office. We have a seven to nine business day processing time here because of how many orders we receive. But long and short of it, that is a tincture. What exactly does tincture do? Well, it depends on what plants you put in with the liquid in the jar. For example, usnea, which we still have quite a bit of in the shop and available is antiviral, antibacterial. It's been proven effective against staph and strep infections in research studies, and it is also antifungal. So it does all the things to kill all the creepy, crawly, icky things that your body might be picking up. Cardamona here helps you with any and everything belly related. Are you bloated? Do you have irritable bowel syndrome? Do you have acid reflux, indigestion? Are you nauseous? Are you throwing up? Do you have diarrhea? Are you constipated? All the things related to your digestive system. We still got plenty of that in the shop too. You guys are sleeping on this one and you shouldn't be. Or, you know, you could go head over and grab a bottle of Contravalor if you are a past or present functioning uterus owner. It's going to help with all things from menstrual cycles all the way through menopause, including PCOS symptoms. Respiratio is your bestest friend when it comes to anything in your respiratory system, COPD, bronchitis, asthma, sinus congestion, all of the things that makes your respiratory system very angry, which by the way, that's a pretty important system. You kind of got to have this one to get by as a human. Romolio is our pain relief blend. So like all things that make your body go, ouch, ouch, eek, I don't like it, it hurts. There you go. And last but not least, Inanyo is the last one that we currently have in stock. This is the one for your lymph system, which is your body's filtration system that helps maintain your fluid balance in your body. So systemic inflammation, lymphedema, anything like that, here's your guy right here that you want to help you out. We do have a few other products in our lineup, but they're out of stock right now. If you want to know when the next restock is happening, it's happening here in the next couple days, you want to head over and join our forum, publumsafterdark.com, because that's where we talk about all the things about when we're updating things and when new products are coming out, which we've got three new ones coming out this week. Yes, all the tinctures can be taken together. And the next question is, how do you take them? Well, it just so happens I've been a slacker taking my own own personal tinctures today so let's go do it together you're gonna grab your bottles that you're gonna take you're gonna squeeze up however much you take in your dropper right here you can either take these straight and have a chaser or you can mix it with coffee juice tea whatever you want to mix it with I just take a mouthful of water and down the hatch they go now a couple other questions I always get asked. What's the difference between vodka based, whiskey based, apple cider vinegar based? Which one do I choose? Well, if you are not living sober or do not have allergies, then it's all up to personal preference because they are all equally effective regardless of the base. Can kids take these? Well, the amount of alcohol content in a single dose, especially for child size, is less than what is in a cup of fruit juice for your child. But we do offer all of our tinctures in apple cider vinegar base for children as well. Can I take more 
than one at a time? Yeah, you can take all of our tinctures together all at the same time if you need to. No, we do not offer sample sizes. We offer them in two ounce and four ounce bottles. We also do not offer them in sets. You cannot place an order if the product is not listed on the website because we only list what is in stock and ready to ship out the door, AKA I don't take pre-orders or you pay me in advance and I hold the product for you. We don't do that. Well, can you send me a text or a message whenever you restock on something? No, I am a very busy lady along with having a family to raise. I do not send out individualized texts, emails, messages, or anything like that. I get too many requests for that, for that to be manageable on my side of things. But we do have a forum, popolimsafterdark.com, that if you sign up and you have the Spaces by Wix app downloaded, you can get push notifications to your phone whenever I post something. And last but not least, I do believe this is the last one I always get asked, can these be used alongside pharmaceuticals or if you are pregnant and or breastfeeding? We are not medical professionals. We are herbalists. I do have a background in nursing. I was an RN for eight years, but it is not my place to advise you on taking herbal remedies alongside pharmaceuticals or during pregnancy. So if any of those conditions apply to you, we suggest that it is best for you to speak with your care provider or a lactation consultant if you are nursing your child. All product information, including a breakdown of what the plants are and what their intended uses are, are listed both on the website and again on the forum, pupplemsafterdark.com. So you can feel free to print that off, take it on your device over to your care provider and have a whole conversation with them. And I think that about covers it all, but also if you want to know where to go grab these things, pupplems.com's first link over in the beacon. So just let me know if you've got any other questions, guys.